Good morning. Thanks so much for having me. It was fun to watch Coach Huger go before me, so I guess you guys are getting treated to a Bowling Green State morning. Um, a little bit about me. My husband was a high school coach. Uh, my father-in-law has been a high school coach for over 45 years up in the state of Michigan. So I applaud you guys. Thank you for all that you do. I'm very aware of the amount of work and time you invest into kids and very grateful for that. Um, I was at Ashton University, about an hour from here, Division II school, for 10 seasons, seven as an assistant, and three as the head coach, and then I just finished up my first season at Bowling Green State University going on year two. Um, I'm gonna share with you guys today something that I think is really, really important. The basketball is obviously very important too, but your you know, culture to me is such a buzzword. Um, <clears throat> but it's really important and it's intentional and it's every day and you have to have a plan for it. And in my opinion, it has to be important to you. Um, I'm gonna give a little bit of a framework. So when I became a head coach, I had already been an assistant at that same school for seven years. So that culture piece I had been part of building. So I moved over one spot um, and it was still important for me to make that my own, but I had already been part of a culture. And so there were so many things that were in place that I didn't necessarily have to think about and be intentional about at the level when I came into a new school. So at Bowling Green State, I'm coming in totally new. I hadn't been part of that program. And that was different. And I learned a lot this year about how intentional you have to be about culture coming into a whole new team. They had all been there, me and my staff were new. 